Hello and welcome to episode 116 of Madhouse Militia Presents, Consuming Fire and Fireworks for Fun and Profit. In this episode, you'll find that we try and get help with our fireworks problems, eat some fireworks, eat some lit matches, make folks concerned and laugh at us, we hear and see strange behavior outside, get gatekeeped from talking to the man, and have many strange conversations with people who should really know better. We wish to give thanks to the following people for helping make the show go, such as Dwight the Janitor. Wasted memory for RogueServer.com, where we broadcast every Friday night at 10 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Pacific, at RogueServer.com forward slash AKSPA. And Dragomir for the Corn Down at Corndown.com, where he broadcasts on RogueServer.com forward slash Dragomir every Friday night at 7 p.m. Eastern, 4 p.m. Pacific. We also wish to give thanks to our patrons, such as Carlos T., Clus Ritz, Experts, Brian N., Mig Chungus, Jayed, Ryan T., Travis B., Goldrust, Gordo, Parkman, Crispy808, MST3Clay, Fancy Pants, Anonymous, Mr. Turbois, Phone Losers of America, Benjamin, Despicable Dogs, Big Boy Farts 666, Jesus Paynus, and Turbo the High Level Squirrel. Make sure to check out our 1000 plus prank call best of 2022, available as a product on our Patreon page. Visit patreon.com forward slash madhouse militia forward slash shop. You can find out more at immoralhole.com. You can find our show archives at travelswithmiriam.com. You can find our YouTube at Madhouse Militia and our TikTok at Immoral Hole. If you wish to contribute to the show, visit immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. Houston Galaxy, how can I help? Like, net, like having sex. Like. Hey, um, this guy right here. He says he sells fireworks for you guys. May I ask who I'm speaking with? My name's Gerber, and this guy said his name was James right. Fireworks. I have fireworks for, like, for fun. May I ask what y'all need? Do you know this guy? He's selling me fireworks. Says he got them from you? It just... I'm a good friend that needs to sell some fireworks I have to no my idea who I to. good friend here. <laughs> hey, um, I'm right here with James Fireworks. Hey. What? I'm right here with the James Fireworks. He wanted to hey. talk to you about your guys' fireworks. I'm not interested. What are you, are you hey. selling fireworks, man? What are you doing? I don't know what I you're doing. I have this guy some fireworks. He says that he got his fireworks from you and you sold him some. When? Hello? Hey, Hello? Bitch. Tell her to shut the fuck up. Hey. Listen to fireworks, how may I help you? Hi, yeah, I'm here hey. with my family. We got a problem with the fireworks you sold us. My my son here, he was he was just you know, opening up the box, and then something weird started happening, and now the whole car is engulfed Bang. with the fireworks. Wow! Wow! How are you gonna fix There's this? There's a black guy right here. There's a black fix guy right it. here lighting fireworks. Fix it! I don't know what the hell. I'm gonna shove a firework up Christie's pussy. I just can't Are you okay? I'm, I'm fucking the shit out of Christy right now. I'm giving her back shot. That's the sound of me hitting her hard. Hello. Hello. Please. Hi. Um. Hello? My friend James Fireworks is interested in some fireworks. What was that, darling? I want to get some my friend, fireworks. My friend James Fireworks is on the line with us. He was interested in buying your fireworks. Hey, okay, me. dear. How do, um, how do we're I... located at 2802 Detroit. Ah, no, we don't need to know where you're located. 
He just wants to know how big the fireworks are. Um, dear, we have 500 grams all the way up to two like, 500. Whoa, 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 like tubular fireworks. Oh, dude, uh, I'm by. I don't need your business app. Jim's Fireworks. We have Jim's Fireworks in the title. Hello? 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 Is this, this, is this, do you guys got the, is this the fireworks place? Uh, no, we don't sell fireworks any longer. Oh, um, what, what, what happened? When did this happen? Uh, I stopped sell, I stopped selling fireworks. The location may still be open, but it's not at this phone number. Are you going to sell them again? Why, 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 why is it like, like, did you get in trouble? Hello? Did you, sir, hello? Dr. Yeah. James Fireworks. Mm-hmm. Cool. Just like a firework up the band instead of a owner. Oh. Oh, uh, hello. I press buttons sometimes, yeah. Good evening. Uh, Thank you for calling Top Dr. Button. Drake's Fund Investors Corporate Office. How can I help you? Come on. Hey, Hi. Do you guys have... The, hello? Are you Hi, do you guys hello? Are you... Oh, you're an AI? Hello? Are you real? Can you hear me? Yes, I just want to know if you're an AI or a human. Uh, this is a real person you're speaking with. My name is David. Oh, great. But how do you know I'm you're real? AI. Excuse me? Like, have you That's sliced down an AI? Have you sliced open your arm to make sure you're not a robot? Like, how do you know? Is there something I can do for yeah. you today? You're calling Top Dog and Greenspan Investors Corporate Office. Are you calling for oh, fireworks? Um, my, my investments. We wanted to invest in a way of, of you getting a boner. How do you make your little PP stand up? Thank you very much for calling. You have a is wonderful that, day. Is that Life a short-term investment? Or? Four Corner Fireworks. Hey, fireworks. Um, I... I, I it's, it was an accident. Um, uh, I just needed to know if the, the fireworks were like, are, you, are they like, like considered poisonous at all? No. No. Uh, if I ate, if I ate, if I ate someone what? by eating, yeah, if you, yeah, if you eat one, yeah, it's going to be poisonous. Don't be eating it. Game, it's, got, how, it's got gunpowder. Well, how, how poisonous is it, though? Is it like, am I going to die? No, I don't think so. Call call the emergency poison control if you and ask them. I don't know. But then they're gonna find out. I mean, if it's just not poisonous, I just don't want to know. I mean, I how much did you eat? Drinking. Um, like we had a big bag of them next to the groceries, and uh, like half of them like went into the like it went into the it it went into the food. They got it all chopped up, and they got to put it into the food. And like, there's a bunch of them in there. Oh, okay. Well, call poison control. I can't help you, sir. I don't know. Why? Am I, we, am I, we, am ate I, him, we ate them with beans can, and rice. You're going to help yeah, us yeah, Did you put, did you put hot spice? Did you put spice, hot sauce on them and stuff? Ow. So, did you put hot sauce? Yeah, ow. Am I going to, am I going to blow up here? I mean, do I guess, can I smoke? What's going yeah, on? Yeah, don't, don't smoke it. Don't smoke it. You'll blow up. To, oh, my fucking God. <laughs> oh, my God. My butt. Oh, oh. How can I help you? My butt's starting to smoke. Am I in trouble? Help me. What's going to uh, happen? Yeah, it sounds like it. Oh, oh God, it's starting to happen. Ah, 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 oh, oh. Ah. Bend over. <laughs> you just one Bend over. Oh, no. Yeah, I uh, <laughs> one cheek left. Oh, his asshole shooting out fireworks. Oh. Oh, 
shit, she's oh. tracking us. Get the cat away. Like yeah, they're like, on the phone for like 20 more seconds. It'll track their location. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just keeping the phone here. She's tracking us. I, she's tracking us. She needs 20 more seconds. Like the other one. No, it's just a flat. Blue boat she's talking. Don't worry, honey. We'll be on the phone until all the fireworks blow up. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. What happens when you send it around to 25 people first? Our locations are now open. Hello? Our hour hey, hello? Oh, shit, I pressed the wrong button. I, I, I got to ask her. I got to ask her a question when she has to Good phone. evening. Hello? Good evening. Thank you. Thank you for calling Top Dogs and Greenpoint Investors Corporate Office. This is BJ. Who's calling, please? Hi, this is Bill. How are you? Bill, I'm fine. How are you? How can I help you today? Well, my wife said that um, she expects to see fireworks and that it's not happening anymore. I was wondering if you could help me with that. Yeah. Well, how, how do I how show? I how do how do how do I make her? Yeah, how do I make her see fireworks? Um, you have to go. You have to go buy the fireworks and set it off. Set them off. Oh no, she said fireworks in the bedroom, like during sex. She says oh. she's not seeing it anymore. <laughs> you won't give me any. Oh my play. god! I can't see fireworks, oh. honey. I tried to get him to give me some foreplay. He says, how about side play? I was like, what are you talking about? I ain't got time you for that, woman. You definitely need that foreplay. <laughs> hey, oh, my God. God. Uh, <laughs> listen to this lady. She ain't... Can, she ain't can I just shoot bottle... I can I just shoot bottle play. rockets so at her? We have five play business. I'm, I'm going to shoot bottle rockets at foreplay. you. You, don't be you quiet. definitely need the foreplay. So, I don't know what that is, and you should be quiet about it because I don't want you giving her ideas. Okay, honey, tell him straighten mm-hmm. this man out. He ain't doing oh, nothing for me. He let me lay there dried up and trying to get the sandpaper going. Oh my goodness! Okay, drink your little show wine you before you get started. That'll help get you going. Oh, gotta get liquored up. Hey, That's good advice. Some wine. ripple wine, that didn't do nothing for me because he just tries to get me all sandpapered up. And I said, oh, hey. be quiet. Be hey. quiet. You drink so much, you got hypnotic coming out your titties. Like, you, 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 you drink it so much, it's coming out. The baby drunk. You don't even buy me no Thunderbird or nothing. You cheap ass. You just cheap. You just cheap. <laughs> <laughs> he won't give me no attention anymore. <laughs> Would you? I mean, I, listen to this mess. This is a mess. I don't know why I married a guy like this. I think I should get a divorce. Tell him, please, I need four Don't, baby. don't, te- don't tease me like that, woman. <laughs> but see, I can't leave. She's gonna get half my shit. Half. Who's going to cook your okay, dinner? Okay, well, you, well, you, all, you all have uh, reached Top Dogs and Greenpoint Investors. This is a firework Halloween. At, uh, I don't even know what that trip. is. That's, that's what I'm telling you. It's fireworks. I can't get no wait, 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 wait. No. Back, back. Back, back, back. Back, back. Mm-hmm. Hey, you said you it's a Halloween. It's, it, hold on. It's, it's an investment Halloween and firework pl- place? What? Oh. Exactly. They do all of that. Is that, that like? The, okay, so, so it's like those clean water places where you get the bottled water, but they're also no, a sir. notary public no. and they also make boba tea. Oh. Well, yeah, it's it's not like that. This is where they they sell fireworks here in Texas. Uh huh. Why? Well, what's the investment part of it? Fireworks. What do you investment. What do you invest? Investment is also they buy property and, and sell it and rent it out. If he would invest oh. a little time, 
Coldplay. I, uh, I'm, I have Italian better. heritage. I know what this is about. So you buy like sort of derelict properties. You quote invest in them. And then you take fireworks and you shoot them at the rundown properties. They catch fire and then you catch the insurance. I got it. Talk, talk, talk. Wink, wink, no nudge, action. nudge. Talk, talk, talk. Well, listen, it was nice talking to you all, and I'm, I've got to go take care of other customers. Thank you. Yeah, you have a good 4th of have July a, there. Tell him one you more too. Make, I make sure your husband you. shows you fireworks so in the bedroom. Fireworks, honey. Please. Thank you, sir. Apple behind. Hello? Sorry, my that was my retarded cousin. Um, mm. We're going to my... We're going to my dad's... Okay, it's my dad's birthday. He's there. He thinks we all forgot his birthday today. Um, so we told him, what do you want to eat? And he said, Applebee's. And we know he's there. Um, we're going to come surprise him in a little bit. So I was wondering if it was okay if you guys go ahead and like surprise him with the brownie right now before we get there. So, like, he knows we're all going to show up, and it's going to be pretty cool. Um, okay. Um, do you know where your dad is sitting at? How does it look like? Um, so, he's, like, a, he's, um, he's probably about 5'9", five, 5'10". Five, he's an older Mexican guy. He probably has a 49er jersey on. Um, he's either wearing a hat or uh, has, like, kind of gel in his hair okay hey don't go up to him his don't go up to him and ask him his name because then he'll he'll get suspicious and he's very like he he'll just you guys just got to surprise him and Um, then he'll know i'll try my best yeah do you see anybody like that right now in there um he could be with my mom and he or he could be by himself oh okay um I can go check. Yeah, go check. I'll wait really good. Okay. Your call is important to us. Hello, thank you for calling Applebee's Petaluma. This is Elena. How may I help you? Elena, hey, my dad's in there. Um, We're all going to surprise him for his birthday. He thinks we all forgot. We all didn't say shit to him this year. We're going to surprise him. He's in there. He's either by himself or with my mom. Um, can you guys surprise him with a brownie? We're on our way right now. We're just running late. Um, yeah, but I don't know. <laughs> um, let me see. He's a, he's a, he's like a, um, like a favorite he's about, or <laughs> No, no. He's either wearing like a Raiders jersey or like a flannel button up. Um he has like gel in his hair. He's an older Mexican guy. So right. um, he's either with my I mom or he's by himself. I think I have a pretty good idea potentially with your mom. Um so you want me to bring out a, like a brownie bite? Yeah, just bring him out a brownie and sing happy birthday to him, but don't ask him his name or anything. He'll he'll get suspicious. He'll you know he'll trip out. You guys just gotta run and give it to him. And I was wondering oh. if you can like leave us to where we can hear it, like to where we can hear the song uh. you guys do, and then pass and then pass him the phone, and we'll say happy birthday to him. Yeah, unfortunately, we uh, uh, corporate policies we can't sing anymore. <laughs> and then I do also apologize. I don't have um, uh, like a cordless phone that would be able to travel to any one of the tables. Um, so I, I don't know. Um, maybe you guys have somebody else that could help facilitate this outside of Applebee's, but I don't know if I'll be able to make can all you, these requests. Can you put him on the phone? Can you bring him to the phone? Can you get him um, to come to the phone? Hold, hold on one moment. We don't have that much time, though. Can you hurry? Wait, no, we Thank don't want to be on hold. No, we don't want to wait. Good evening. Thank you for calling Top Duck and Greenspoint Investors Corporate Office. How can I help you? Hello? Hello? Sorry, I was talking to my wife. Um, I I have an issue. Hi, how can I help you? I have an issue. Tell me. 
It's number it's number three hundred and twelve in the centerfold, like she has a half a bush. Like she started out like doing the bear on the one side. What it is, bro. Good evening. Yeah, and that's why I took the finger Thank out of my for... asshole because it Hello. felt too good. I was Ba-da, 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 da. Hello? 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 Who is this? Who is this? You call me. This is Jack. Ooh. Thank you for calling Blackjack Fireworks. How can I help you? Hello? Thank you for calling Blackjack Fireworks. How can I help you? Hi. Hi. How- I need some fireworks stat. Okay. Yeah, um so I'm, I'm okay, I'm doing a really strange 4th of July party. Um, have you ever seen Indiana Jones and the Ark of the Covenant thing or whatever it is, Raiders of the Lost Ark, you know that thing? No, I have not seen them. Well, I got the German guy who, like, his face melted in the movie. You remember that guy? When he opened no, I the have never. No, I've never seen that. Oh, well, I was the actor there. Yeah, we're going to have a big party. I want to recreate it. Yeah, so we need, like, a firework that's going to, like, melt faces because we need to reenact that movie. What do you recommend? Well, I don't think we like have anything sh- like ones? that, but... Um. Uh, it was, well, what about I, actually, those ones that like shoot sparks everywhere, like the shower ones? You know, the spark shower, whatever they're called. They go. The, the fountain. And there's sparks everywhere, all crazy. Yeah, those are fountains. The fountain. You think if I put it in his face, it would melt like a wax candle, like in the movie? Yeah, those would be fountains. Well, why don't we, it could be like a bunch of snakes and put those all over my face and light those on fire and they would go like. Good afternoon, Firework Supermarket. Hello. Hey. 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 Um, hey. I have yeah. this German guy right here and he says that it's okay if you put some of the gunpowder from the firework in the blunt and smoke it. Is that true? I don't know. You'd have to ask some Here, I'll let you ask yeah, so, CJ. Yeah, you know, he was very high, yeah. Like, you put it in there, you just put it in the end, and it goes pop, and you go fucking... But you get a fun, like, Hello? you get a crazy head Hello? rush. Hey, um, I have this German guy that says in Germany they always put some of the firework stuff into a blunt, and they smoke it with the Mary J. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he's right here. Yeah, Hi. Word Tennessee, Alabama. Tennessee, yeah, Alabama. Hello? Is this a fireworks place? Yes. Oh, fantastic. Hey, uh, my my honey's birthday is on the 4th of July, and we want to have a celebration. So uh, we've got marijuana brownies, and we want to put some candles on top of there. And since his birthday is the 4th of July, you know, so I want to find out if you have a particular product that we could put on there. Um, I don't think we do. Oh, okay. Now, I was told that y'all sold these last year, and they're called Roman dick candles, and they kind of look like a penis. But it's a Roman candle that shoots out a lot of sparks instead of goo. They call them a Roman dick candle. Do you all sell them there? We do not. Oh, my goodness. Well, where could I find some? Because that that flying goo sparkle really, really gets them excited. Yeah, they're um, at the fireworks, like down our road. They may have some if you call them. Um, but just look up fireworks stores near Kimball, Tennessee, and it'll pull it up. Hey, honey. Honey. Uh-huh. Did, yes, you ask her, did you ask her if she had them fireworks that makes words when they go off? 
Yeah, yeah. you tell them what we're looking for. They don't have the Roman dead candle this year, but what what else could we get? Ma'am? Yes. Ma'am, are you there? Yes, sir, I am. Uh, I was wondering if you got the fire... Oh. Fireworks New Market, how can I help you? Uh, yeah, we got a little situation. We were there earlier. We got uh, we got a bunch of stuff, and my kids have been playing with it. My grandfather's been playing with it, and uh, I don't know. Uh, they said they, they re-armed it, they de-armed it. Things are escalating beyond my wildest dreams of what would ever happen after going to a star. I'm going to need you to move it down to DEFCON 2. My car, my car. What's this firecracker in my Good evening, Good evening, no, Power not Supermarket. Right, not, right, not right now. I ran out of the loop. I'm trying to... Go. Hello? Hello? Yeah, why... I I tried to get this self-lubricating fireworks. These ones seem dry. Did I get ripped off? Yeah, you did. I'm so sorry about that. How are we going to put it in there now? It's too dry and rough because all the, the cap it off with that rough shit yeah, and the powder. Yeah, it's dry like this woman's scalp. Oh, I'm oh my so God, sorry. How are we going to put it in there? Are you supposed I to don't put know. it in there and we're going to light it and I'm going to fart it out like super high yeah. speed? Well, good luck with that. This like a Pornhub video. We're going to do a whole like... <laughs> fuck. Yeah. So what are you going to... Wait. Did you not? You didn't. You. They said very wet, um, water lubricated. What you like? We paid extra for these. What we gonna do? Yeah. Hold on a minute, and I'll get you an expert on that. No, okay? we're not holding on because the guy yeah. that sold them to us for we paid extra. Okay. Well, I'm so sorry about that. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Sorry, my 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 other boyfriend here. Yeah. Uh, fat sacks. What are you saying? Okay. Well, I hope it works a, out for you. Um, Have a good night. We we had it. No. Hey, don't hang nope. up. Oh. Hello. Hello. Oh. Hello, my, for, Hello. my horse. He ate the fireworks. What do I do? Oh God. Yeah. What's wrong? My horse. He ate the fireworks. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Come on, horse. Your horse. What? Hey, you caught my decorations on fire. I got Donald J. Trump in a sleigh with the American flag on it, and it just caught fire. Who is this? Who is this? This is Bo Jiden. This is Bo Jiden. How are you? Doing good. Hi, Bo. Hi, Bo Jack. Who do you want to talk to? I want to talk to anybody who knows what happened to my mind because I lost it. This is Bo Jiden. I approve this message. Uh, I don't you know. Who is this, for real? What do you want? This is Bo Jiden. I just want to sit in front of the fireplace in a rocking chair. No, I said Bo Jiden. I know both. Yeah, it's true. Nobody. But it's both. Nobody. They're not going to say that. Both. What's going on? You want to sit in a rocking chair and do what? I want to sit in a rocking chair and smoke my pipe and read stories that I won't remember five minutes later. <laughs> <laughs> Fireworks. He had fireworks going off in the background. What, what happened to your fireworks? I put them in my asshole. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, shit. 
Uh, Hang up now, big boy. Big job. It's closing time. I don't know. Closing time. You got them with the pussy. Last call for alcohol. Hinty fireworks. Order your whiskey or beer. I have a, a couple questions for you about them goddamn fireworks. Okay. You see, I coach a semi-professional basketball team, and we just signed on loan this German kid who came from Germany. His name is Johan. Okay. Are you are you following me, son? Yeah. Now he told me, and I'm just asking him before because I don't care. I'll buy him whatever you know. But he said that in Germany they fuck the fireworks and it makes them play better. They put their little penis inside the hole and light it, and it makes them go faster and they get better at shooting. Uh no. What do you, you mean? Know. What he's talking about? You pack, you compact it, mm, mm, mm. and because the special jewel says that you have on the penis, it it compact and it combusts so much better. Yo, yo, yo! This is your you see, honor, by the way. You see, I don't think he's lying. Are you calling him a liar? Hi, this is Shirley. Yeah, How you head. doing there, Laverne? We're doing good. Oh, How are you guys? Shit. Hey, I'm My good. When are you are you coming to the, the bottling plant today to work or not? What's going on? Yeah, what kind of Laverne. Shirley? Possum Pepper Incorporated? Da, 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 da. We're gonna make it. We're gonna put Caps on bottles and, and somehow pay the rent. Mouth. Oh, what? <laughs> oh. What happened? Hello? At, oh, God, not the fireworks again. <laughs> I want to know how you're going to pay the rent putting caps on bottles. Firework is in Spanish. Los fuegos artificiales. Wow. Hello? Yes. Hello. Uh, Hi, I'm looking. I'm looking for the fuegos artificiales. You know? Los fuegos? <laughs> I do not know. It's a fireworks no. gringo, you know? Fireworks, they... What? <laughs> what happened? Yeah, I know fireworks. I don't know. Yeah, we call them los fuegos. Artificiales. We want, we want thing the fireworks to light in front of our house. Me and my boyfriend. <laughs> we gonna uh, we gonna chew them up each other's fun. ass too, you know. <laughs> I you can hold this. Uh, I can hold a sparkler uh, between my cheeks, you know. I bet you can. I've got some. Special Although the last, you say you, you say you time, have uh, butt plugs. No, yes. it's a sparkler. <laughs> Last time I waited too long and the sparkler burnt my butt hair, you know. It, it's it's okay. It grows back. He hasn't grown back yet. Okay. Well, good. You know, people pay a lot of money to remove hair from their ass, so I consider myself very lucky, you know. Very special. So where'd, where'd you go, gringo? Where are you going? I'm not going anywhere. I was waiting for you at the store. Hey, you you to come out. You, working with, you working with chickens? I can probably hear chickens in the background. Yes, we have chickens. I hear chickens. And is that a fucking dog? Was that a perro barking too? 
Yes. Tu pinche sí. perro. Do you have pigs? Do you have pigs over there? Yes. How big is the pig? Is it big one or is it hairy pig or is it pink, black pig? What is? Why do you have? I don't know. Why do you have so many animals, man? What's wrong with you? Cat. Why are you keeping so many animals? Is something wrong with you? So is your oh, pig? Man. Is it big? Is it big pig? And baby. Excuse me, room. This is Maddie. Can I help you? Hello. 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 Where, what, um, with, with, which hospital? Who? Home hospital? Who, what, where, and when? Who, what, hospital. where, and when? That's what you're, yeah. What are you talking about, baby? Okay. Who, what, where, when? <laughs> I was trying to pull a car, a car window, you know. Well, as I used to. Thank you for calling the Fairfield Inn and Suites in Rome. This is Addison speaking. How may I help you? Ron, listen, um, when is the black smoke going to come out of the Vatican? I, I don't see anything yet. Uh, excuse me? Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to watch. They're, trying, uh, they're making the new selection of the Pope, but I don't see any black smoke coming from the Vatican yet. What's going on here? Ah. Uh, um, no, the Vatican, no. Sorry? Are you Hello? okay? Are you, are you dove, yeah. dove la fontana di tre? Can I help you? Buongiorno. Yeah, this guy's Mexican. He's trying to show me around. Gotcha. What he's, 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 he keeps telling me about the gabagool. We're Mexican and we're gay. Non sono mexicano. Sono paisano. I think you like man is Italian. Mambo Senor? Italiano. Yeah, Mambo number five. Senor? Hello? Are you re entering the Earth's atmosphere at this time? Hello, sir? The raison d'etre. He Sir? put it the phone. He put it the phone down. Schadenfreuden. He's he's finishing himself off, and then he's going to pick up the phone again. Oh, he's coming back. Ubuntu. Hmm. Battery low. Hello? Thank you for calling the Santa Clara Hotel. How may I help you? Hello? Um, me and my boyfriend, Dwight, we want to get a room. Okay. Uh, if, for, it's for, if it's for tonight, I'm 100% booked for tonight, sir. Yeah, but oh, that's no, okay. Dwight's not going to like it. Yeah, could you find us a room that we could book maybe with two other gentlemen in there right now? And we'll just pile on top of them. <laughs> if, if that was an option, sir, then we could do that, but I, I don't have anything at the moment. No, listen, we'll do room share. We'll do room share. We'll pick up 75% of the tab. <laughs> if it was only that simple, boss. <laughs> listen, 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 listen. Are you doing this because we're gay? No, sir. Because we're trying to get into a room because I have a key fob I want to put inside of my boyfriend, and then I want to push him and beep him, unlock and lock the doors. Mm, well, you'd be more welcome to do that if I had a room, but I don't have a room, boss. I'm going to do it in the hallway because I'm gay. I, I wouldn't recommend that. <laughs> Why not? Because I'm hey, gay. Sir. No, hey, sir. Because you would get, I have, in, um, you would get in trouble. Go ahead. I get shot? Oh, my God, for being no. gay? 
no, I mean, surveillance would catch you on camera, and then security would come Being and get gay? you guys real fast. Security will come, security will come get me because I'm gay? It has nothing to do with, because you're gay, I'm just saying, it's just a policy on, like, you know, public. Why do you, why'd you, why'd you say I was gay like that? Why'd you say it all aggressive? What's the matter with you? Murk, Can I help you with anything, sir? Can I help you with yeah, anything? Why are you, why are you against me? Is it, yes. is it the policy of the hotel or you, because I'm gay? I have sir, a question I've, for I've, you. I've met, I've had gay friends and I met gay people. I have nothing against them. Whatever. Yeah, you said so, had. Okay, what you do? I have you a get question. Rid of them? You get I have a question. Okay, if there's nothing else I can help you with, gentlemen. You fucking idiot! I'm asking you a fucking question. You know, listen, I kick in the ass, so you idiot son of a bitch. Hey, if you wanna if you wanna calm down and then we can f- resolve the situation, then we can do that. But you're not gonna call me a fucking idiot over the phone, okay? You fucking idiot son of a bitch! I kick in the ass, so you. Oh, why won't you come tell me that in person, boss? You don't do nothing. You what? Uh, you think because I'm gay I can't fight? No. Why don't you come tell me in person and then we'll find out. Okay. How about this? English or Spanish? English, bro. So I can understand you. So I know what you're saying. Who, who, whoever, whoever talks next is gay. Hello. Yeah, somebody call me. What are you talking about? What? What do you? How do you know uh, my number? I just put. What, on what my is my phone, phone number? And, uh, hell, hang on a second. Okay. What is my phone number? What is what well, is my phone number? If, if you don't need me, then fuck off. It's five oh two. Yeah, I'm getting phone calls. All right. It was somebody called me from this number, so I'm calling you back. Hello. That's what I'm telling you. What? I said you, I got a phone call from this number, so I'm returning your call. What? Fuck you. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, yeah, hi, I'm back here. Uh, it's very dark. I can't seem to find my way out. Uh, the machines are whirring around at me, and I, I'm very confused and lost. Uh, oh. Well, good for you. Oh, how do I get out of here? Oh. Hey, what are you doing back here, man? You're not supposed to be back here, man. I, uh, where are you? I can't see you. How do I get out? I'm coming. Where are you, man? Keep talking. I can't find you. Come over here. Hey, what? Whoa, what's that? I can't see you, man. Tell me where you are. Keep yelling. What's that? It will be necessary to touch it. I love the boobies in the window shit. That was Thank so you fun. for calling the Hampton Inn. How may I assist you? Um, hello, how may hello? I assist you? Um, I was walking by because my room is inside. And when I was walking, there was people in the window, and the lady had the window open, and she showed me her pussy and her titties, and I said, what the fuck is going on? Like, yeah, Maybe it goes somewhere else. Hello? Hello? Hi, yeah, I was looking to book a room here. I was wondering if you had any rooms, first off. If not, then I guess I'm wasting everybody's time, right? <laughs> Oh. Where it is? Oh, you have room? So, where are you looking for? The room motel or relax in? Well, I'm looking to relax inside the hotel. Uh, I was hoping that I could right now if you had some rooms. Yeah, we do. Where are you? Okay. Oh, I'm outside here. I'm waving. You see me? I'm looking through the windows. I'm trying to look through the windows anyway, but God, there's a lot of trash out here. You know who dumped all this trash here? It looks like uh, there's like a lot of posters and, and uh, refuse here. It's like building materials for a house. Is someone like moving in or moving out? I didn't see you anywhere. You may be wrong. Here, let me, let me give my brother the phone because maybe he can... I, I, I don't know. I, I'm going to go re- go through all this stuff. Here. Yeah. I want to see if there's any magic going on. Here, take the phone. Someone, take the phone. Hello? 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 
Hi. Yes, where are you guys? We're outside in the by the van with the German guy that's trying to give us pillows. Tell you this place, the pillow sucks. I will give you a pillow for one dollar. Best pillow you ever had. You will take it with you or have it for a hundred years. He's saying that his pillows are better than your guys. Who is this guy? The pillows in this place, flat, pathetic, stained if you take the pillowcase off. Hey, dude, don't be saying sh that shit about them, dude. They ha they gave us a room, bro. Mm, bro. Mm -hmm. So I'm not to be rude about Basement. Thank you for calling the Homewood. How can I assist you? Oh. Oh. Hello? Yes, hello. This is the Homewood. How can I assist you? up like a month ago and I haven't been running as much and I gained like three or four, like three pounds. Thank you for calling Southwest Marriott. Like strange life. That's not going to help you. Yeah, hi. There's this guy. He's wearing, um, do you know what plastics are? Like the sauna, sauna suits? They're called sauna suits as well? Um, sure. Well, they're, they're like an extra size thing that like it's, it's airtight so that when you run, you sweat and you just perspirate into it. He's okay. over here running up and down the steps and he keeps pulling out the elastic and he empties his sweat all over the stairs. And I slipped and fell. Um, what side of the building is that on? I, the side with the stairs. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, oh, 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 like, yeah, yeah. Which they got rooms the are down. you by? Well, I'm I'm actually semi semi stupid when it comes to directions. Uh, it's over by the uh, two fifteen. Like so the, uh, the lower side, the lower side of the two hundred. Uh, like over by two hundred and two hundred one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The beginning, right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna place you on a brief hold. Uh huh. Thank you. Oh, okay. Stupid. Oh. Stupid. Man, when Turbo worked when Turbo worked at a hotel, he would have never stood for this. Moist, make it moist. All right, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it. Try Thank you for it. calling Quality in, Whoa. Oneida. Oh, na oh, na na. Thank you for calling you. Quality in. This is Daniel. How can I help you? Hi, Daniel. Hey, can I suck your cock? <laughs> All right, man. You guys have a good one. What do you mean, guys? <laughs> Survived. That's Western and, and Utica Unark. How, how may I help you? Hello? Oh, uh, uh, hello? Yes. Hello? How can I help you? Yeah, I'm I'm outside here. I was trying to get a a room here, but uh, before I came in, I was just I was looking up at the windows, and I just kind of wanted to uh, alert you guys to something that I saw going on up there. Where? Uh, I don't know. I think it was like the second or third floor. They've closed the blinds and like the curtains now, but the windows open, and I saw the lights, and there was like a silhouette of people. They were like doing some adult stuff up up there if you know what I mean but like in plain sight of the parking lot oh my, I can hear it must be the second floor because it's you know it's the second it must be the second yeah okay that was the I didn't see a window I'm sorry I'm just really shaken up because I can kind of hear them because the windows open but there was like a you know the lights in the back and you could see like the, the shadows Quality in Sunday, so can Hi, yeah, we're watching this video on the TV, and uh -huh. this lady, she's like, she's yelling and screaming, and uh, oh. it looks like the, it looks like it's video from your security cameras. Like, do you have like bugs in the hotel with like hidden cameras in the rooms or something? 
because it looks like my room. It's the same very, room style. Very, What's very, on the TV? Uh, which, which room number are you in? Oh, well, I'm in the room that's next to, I guess, like the you know, stairs up here. And this lady, it doesn't, it's not my room because it's not laid out exactly the same, but it has all the same like fixtures. Yeah, yeah. I come and check, but are you in which room oh number? God. So, it, beside your room, uh, it, noise is coming. You tell me. Oh, no, it's not coming from my room. It's not coming from near the room, though. It's it's on the yeah, TV. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I turn on oh, the TV. Oh, TV. Yeah, I tell I them. The video. I tell them. Yeah, I tell them uh, uh, not uh, too loud uh, noise, but you tell me which, are you in which room? After that, oh, I tell them. Oh, no, 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 no. It's... But, I turn on the TV. Okay. And this is what's playing on the TV, but it looks like it's it's like somewhere in the hotel. Scream as loud as huh? you want, baby. Fuck this hotel. Yeah, it looks like this is live. Like someone's streaming this on your TVs through the like the internet what? or something. Someone's oh. doing this here. It's like someone's making you know? uh, pornos and it's streaming on the TV. I just come yeah, and I check it there. You know me. One show? second, ma'am. Yeah, I'm putting that pussy on every channel. I come and oh. check it there, man. One second, I come and check it there. Oh, okay. I come there. Oh, yeah. yeah. I think that's what's going on here, too. Oh, yeah, the door is open. Oh, everybody watching, the door is open. Come on in and fuck. Yeah, 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 yeah. I come. One second. Okay, please. I think. Mumbai nurse, was that it? Was that oh, the yeah, it was something like that. Oh. That's breakfast. Ann and Alan Frederick hosts. No one's available to take what? your call at this time, but if you will need your name, phone number, All and right, a brief me, message, we'll get back thing. to you as soon as we can. Thank you for calling. Hello. Uh, oh, hello. Hi. I was uh, was wondering if you were going to be there or not. Um, I had questions regarding your uh, establishment and uh, what sort of clientele that you enjoy uh, having. Hmm. What is this about? Oh, I was just I was looking to uh, to book some time there to uh, lie down and sleep, mostly. Hmm. Well, that's what people do here. People yeah. come and sleep overnight. Yeah, I know. That's what I want. I get to do. all kinds of people. Yeah. You name it, people from all over the place. Yeah. Sounds good to me. So, how much is it, boy? Hey, man, do you want a place where I can suck your dick yet, or what? Yeah, I'm, I'm trying. I've got, I got him on the phone. I just got to, I just got to, I just got to make plans, okay? <laughs> I, I, I just, I just, I, 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 I'm gonna, well, it's gonna, it's gonna be all good. Everything's gonna be good. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, listen, yeah. Uh, we want to come. We want to come. We want to come in, and I want to put a sheet over him, like I'm doing an autopsy, and suck the rigor mortis out of his dick. I'm Hilton Gardner. This is Mark speaking. Come in. Hi. Uh, I'm trying. What is the uh, Wi-Fi password for the bed sheets? The Wi-Fi password for what? The bed sheets. For the I'm trying to down sh- I'm trying to download yeah, the bed sheets. I'm trying to download the app because I've been trying to pull the bedding and the sheets back for like like I don't know, the last half an hour because I'm ready to go to bed. But it, they're not coming back and like it keeps saying something about I, that I have to unlock the sheets, so I gotta get the password. S- sir, I'm not sure the, the the betting doesn't require a password. Okay, then how come the, I can't pull them back? I, I I'm not sure, sir. I don't know what an app would have to do with the betting on a bed. Well, it says the Wi-Fi for the sheets. So I don't. Is there a special uh, like network I need to connect in order to unlock them? Like put in my room number? Do I need a username and password? What do I do? The the only Wi-Fi is our standard Wi-Fi connection, which is the Hilton Garden and HGI, and that's your last name and your room number. Um, okay, so then I just use that to unlock the bed sheets then? 
So the Wi-Fi has nothing to do with the bed sheets. Password rejected. Yeah, see, I just tried to put it in again. I tried to get in. I put my last name in and my room number, and I tried to unlock the bed sheets and nothing. So, sir, again, I have no idea what you're talking about because there's no Wi-Fi connection to the bed sheets. Please try again. There's a Wi-Fi connection to bed sheets has phone. been separated. A stupid phone. Um, no, there was when I got in here, there was like a little placard. It was like it was laminated. It said to unlock the bed sheets, you need the password. Yeah, for the Wi-Fi. Sir, I, I have. What room are you in? A two fifteen. Please try again. Your password is currently hey, what, what? It's, it's asking. See, it's asking for a password to unlock the bed sheets, but I don't. Like I said, I don't know the password. So, so, the, so there's no Wi-Fi to the bed sheets. The bed sheets don't have Wi-Fi. Bed sheet safe locked. Please enter password. See, that's not what this sir, app is saying. Your guys' app is saying. I, I have, that, saying sir. Wi-Fi. I have no idea what app you're on, but it has nothing to do with this hotel. Uh, well, this is the one I used to do the, all the check-ins and everything. Like, when I d- entered in the password and stuff to get on the Wi-Fi, it popped this up. This popped up when I connected. Please enter um, the password sir, I, on I, bed I, Sir, I don't know what that is, but that is not ours. That has nothing to do with us. It keeps talking about a thread error count. Uh, it says it's two-factor sir, that has, enabled. I, and I don't, I don't have a, a two-factor authorization application. A password Thread count anything. too high for credit score. Please try again or enter a new card. I don't understand. I, what do I do next? How do I get the Wi-Fi for the sheets? Thread count 300 approved. Burlap sack dispensing. Hello, sir. Thank you. Have a gay day. Circus and Omalty. Circus and Hi, are you a banchot? What's that? Um, Hello? Are you a banchot? Hello. Are you? Are you a banchot? No, I am not. Are you? I am not. Are you sure? We have a camera. You can look in the phone. Oh, what do you see, big boy? Because if you look in the camera, you see I'm here with your sister. Gandhi detected. Sorry, I don't have a sister. Your mother, then. Your mother was right here, too. And I kissed her on the bubble butt. Banchoed alert. What do you want? Gandhi, I, I wanted Gandhi. you to, I wanted you to come join us, me and your sister, because you are a Banchoed. Oh fuck you! Come join Holt Lantern. Huh? No, that's for you Excuse to see the sister. Marachod dispensing. What'd you say, Kari Maki Bosrike? Go and fuck your sister. Please hold oh. for Big Bode Mosh. Head for Big Bode Mosh. Hello. Hi. Hi. How you doing? Yep. I was looking to get a room. I uh, know we don't I'm have out. Oh yeah. Well, I was outside and I noticed that there's people. They're taking like a toilet out of the room. And they're like taking things out. They're just dragging it out in the parking lot. They said that it's a it's a it's a yard sale. They said they said that they work for you and they're doing a yard sale and they're selling the toilet. I thought that was a little weird. Where's your room number? Well, no, I'm not staying here, right? I was I was calling to get a room, but I was I was walking by and I noticed, hey, there's people. What are they doing? And I saw them. They're dragging the toilet out of the room. Like they're taking all the pipes out, and they got the pipes out here. They're selling all the pipes. Oh, uh, okay, I will check it out. It's a yard sale. It's a yard sale. Yeah, okay, I will check it out. Oh, can I buy the toilet? Because I really have to go to the bathroom. Okay, you can call 911 for that. Why? Hey, oh, why? fuck you, you fucking little pussy. Thank you for calling 
Stephen and Sweets. This is Don. Can I help you? Hi, uh, yeah, there's a loud Don. person here. A very loud. Hello? Oh. Don, where's the Indian guy? Hello? Don, can you hear us? Uh, I can hear both of you, but nobody's answering me. What can I help you with? Uh, no, you're ignoring us. We've been talking this whole time. That's rude. Either answer my question or I'm hanging up the phone. Is there something I can help you oh. with? Wow, that's extremely good customer service you have. Yeah. You're going to talk to my brother. You're going to talk to my brother and you're going to help him with this problem. How about that? Go ahead. Talk to her. Yes, hello. Hi, I am sorry I'm not available. Please sorry. leave a message. Oh, Thank she's you. Sorry. I have to tell her. Hello. Sorry hello. Oh, God. Uh, we accidentally ingested the fireworks, and then we 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 ate the matches. Uh, well, uh, what do you want us to do afterwards? Can you give me a call back? That'd be great. Thank you so much. Well, well, gosh, I'm gonna bust. Oh no! Did Dwight say he was going oh. back? You have reached Judy from the Antique and Irish Welch House, Ben oh, and Breakfast. Oh, Judy. Please leave your name, number, and a brief oh, message, yes, and I will get there as soon as possible. Good day. Thank you. Crispy. Good day. Good day. Please record yeah. your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hello, Judy. Listen, I had an accident at the property. I need you to give me a call back as soon as possible. Oh, God. How long ago were the back springs? Hi, is there a guy working there? Uh, I don't know his name, but he helped me. I just want to know if I could talk to him. There's a dude. It was a couple, like, hours ago or maybe not even an hour ago. How did he help you? Uh, he, I asked him for something, and he helped me, and I don't really have to tell you because it's a guy thing. Okay, so this is a recorded line. That's why I'm asking you because, you know, it is a recorded line, and I need to see what guy you're talking about because there's multiple guys. Well, he was Mexican. Or he looked brown. Sorry. Thank you for calling, Paul. I'm recording. How may I help you? Hey, so you guys just hang up on people in the middle of the sentence? That's how you guys I'm handled your customer service? I'm sorry. I, I just answered the phone right now. I don't know who, who were you speaking with earlier. Well, you're, well you're, F, you're, 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 sorry. your coworker hung up on me. I asked to speak to the dude there. And she had an attitude about it. That's bullshit. Sorry. Bull S H I T. <laughs> okay. So do you get did you get the name of the person? I didn't. He's he's Mexican or something. I just want to talk to him. He helped me like an hour ago. A Mexican an employee here? Oh no. Yes. We don't have an, no, we don't have an employee here that's a Mexican guy. No. He he, he could have been white. He could have been white. I don't know. Did you get the name? Because there's no one here but two people. No. Can I talk to the guy what? there? There's no guy here right now, sir. I'll put it up your pussy. <laughs> okay. Yeah, do it. You probably like it. Hang up. Oh, yeah? <laughs> your mama. Yeah, hang up. Get back to work. Go grab a... This is Daryl speaking. How can I help you? Daryl, is it just the person I wanted to talk to, bro? Who is this? May I ask? Hello? Who is this? Uh, this, is Hector Ramirez. Uh, this is Hector Ramirez. My friend Crispy's on the phone. Hi. Mm. I'm not familiar. She uh, said... Yes. Yeah. She How said, she said you fucked her. She said you fucked her when she was staying there. You started fumbling. Oh, Julie, what can I get to you? 
Hello? Julie, where's the goddamn man that works? I need to talk to him right now. Say what? There's a man working there. I need to talk to him right now. What man? The big man. Are you asking for a manager? No, there's a man working, Julie, honey. I'm not sure who you were looking for. Do you have a name? Okay, I, how many guys are working there? No, I don't have a name. I just need to talk to the man working. There's a man there working. Put the man on. I'm not quite sure which man you were talking about. I have multiple men. Okay, we'll put the man on. And if it's not him, I will tell them and they'll put the right one on. It's that simple. I don't need to talk to you. Are you looking for a manager? Or are you looking for a Yeah, manager? sure. Yeah, I want a manager. Okay, well, I am the manager on Jeopardy. A manager. I am the Oh, manager. my Jesus the Christ. Manager. Oh, my God. I need maintenance. I need maintenance then. I don't need you. I need a man. What did you not get? Like, what do you not... This call may be monitored or recorded for training purposes. Were you the one? Hi, who is this? This is Jerry. Who is this? Where did you say you were calling from? Where did you... You got my number. It's funny that you should call. Because... My third eldest, Larissa, was talking about it last week. Who was? Uh, Someone did call last week about the same thing, was that you? What was it about? She was the first in the family to go to university. So we're all really quite proud of her. Uh -huh. What are you proud of? I'm sorry, I couldn't exactly hear you there. What are you proud of? What was that again? What was, are you proud of? Her? Could you say that again, please? What, what happened? Well, you know, here's the thing. What is the thing? The last time someone spoke to me on the phone, I got in quite a bit of trouble because, well, my oldest, Rachel, wouldn't speak to me for a week, and that really hurt. And sometimes these things are really quite important. You know, no matter what it is... Well, this is the craziest phone call I've ever heard. Well, you know, since you put it that way... Uh, you've been quite kind to me. I don't even know who you are. Oh, are you still there? I'm sorry, my hearing is not so good. What were you saying again? I said I don't even know who you are. I'm sorry, I have got diarrhea. And you caught me at a bad time. Can you say that again, please? <laughs> well, that does sound good. Yes, yes, you've been quite kind to an old guy like me. Now, Larissa, my third eldest, I believe I've talked about her before. She's quite the smartest and... We're in the... I found a picture in the behind the mirror. Thanks for calling Lowe's and Tolleson. My name is Lynn. How may I help you? Hello. Hi, this is Lowe's and Tolleson. My name is Lynn. How can I help you? Hello. So I'm in currently in the men's restroom and I'm I had a bit of a complaint for you. You're in our restroom currently? Yes, that is correct. Um and so what is going on is like if there's a mirror, of course, in here, I'm sorry, I'm German, if I'm not saying so, that's right, there's a mirror in here. And you see mm -hmm. yourself? But I noticed there was something peeking out from behind it. And so if I tug on this piece of paper, it was a picture of a woman showing her boobies like it is pornography. Okay, give me a second. I'll send my manager directly in there. Give me a second. Well, no. Will you let me talk to him, please? Because I'm, I'm, I'm in the toilet, please. Please, a little bit well, of privacy. Well, he can talk to you through this stall. 
Talk to me to the phone, please. Please, I beg you. I am in the toilet. I'm German. It's different customs. I beg you. I'm my first time in America. This is a little bit surprising for me. I'm trying to help you. Give me a second. Please, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, this is Ramon. Hello, Ramon. Um, I'm Johan. I'm currently in the bathroom. It's a bit of a sensitive situation that you tell you anything. Give me one second, sir. Welcome to Costco. I'll be right with you. Hello? Can you repeat that, sir? So, yes, I was on the phone with your empl- uh, uh, a call worker there, and I, I have an issue in the bathroom currently. I'm from Germany. I'm sorry if I'm not saying the right words. It's my first no, it's time okay. in America. But there was, yeah. like, I was looking in the mirror, you know, behind the mirror. Like, the, I, there's, like, the space between the wall and the mirror. There was, like, a piece of paper poking out. And so I pulled it, just curious, and it was, like, Pornography. It was a picture of a woman and her boobies and, and such. But that is oh, like, really? okay. Whatever one. Oh, really? Yeah, it was like one problem, not a problem. I could throw it away. It's like whatever. But I'm looking around here and I'm seeing there's a bit more in in this room. Like there's some. There's like I looked in the toilet stall and there was a, a corner also hanging out like a page. And so I pulled the top porcelain of 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 the toilet tank and it go. Inside the you, you said in the men's the restroom. Yeah. At the love, sir, in Tolson. Yeah, exactly. That's why I'm at now. I am calling you. And so, yes, that is what that is the oh, situation. Okay. I already confirmed this with the with the other woman. All right, I appreciate it, sir. I'll have our maintenance team well, go and no, look at it. Okay. Like, wait, I'm looking here. There's a man here. He's got a backpack. And he's like tucking, oh, like you know the um um the thing that come down you put you try um um with the paper there's like a thing. He's All right, it sir. I'm gonna have my machine. maintenance team go and look at it. Okay. Can you hear him? We'll he's take care of it. Shit to me. Hey, get away! You're not supposed to do that. All right, Hang sir. On, we'll man. be right I'll in there. You in the ass, man. No. I- Hello, good morning. How can I help you? Yeah, uh, we were in there earlier, and we got a big-ass bag of chips. Mm-hmm. And what else? And I just wanted to know why the fuck these chips are so old. Mm. Give me one second. Hold on. I'm sorry. Look at the date on this piece of shit. Jeez. Dude, you can't even talk to the fucking girls at the truck stops anymore. It's like they're hiring the most brain dead, most really? fucking like. It's not even. It's, they're like, oh, I gotta pass I, you on to somebody else because I'm too stupid. To I deal sense with it. nothing coming from these calls when these fucking girls answer at the truck stops. I'm sorry. No soul, I no sense psychic nothing coming out of these. What kind of chips are they? The big chips. What kind? What like? What brand? You know. I don't know the fucking spicy chips, the goddamn spicy chips. Okay. Um. What's your name, sweetie? Rose. Rose, was it you that helped me? I was there an hour ago. I was not here. The I don't know what time you came in. But I just clocked in right Can now. Can I come and in and get some new chips from you? Um, going to have to talk to my manager I'll bring the old bag. You're going to have to talk to Why? my manager don't. about that. See, this is bull... No, I don't want to involve no bullshit. I just... They've gone home to by Hilton of Fort Smith. This is Tyler, man. Hi. Yeah, I'm out here. I'm out here. Uh, I got a little problem, a little situation. I... When I pulled in with my my bike, um, there's a hole over here, and it got it got sucked in the hole. And now there's a crowd of people here that are trying to help me fish the bike out, but it's not looking too good. I was wondering if you knew about this this hole problem out here. And uh, are you in the parking lot of the hotel? I'm guessing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a hole here. I, I mean, I drove up. I thought it was a little low, but I, it took my bike. It just went. 
down um, into the hole it went. What er, what side of the parking lot are you in? I'm on the left side over here. Um, there's a there's a whole crowd of people now. All of a sudden, uh, they, they noticed it was kind of weird, and uh, so they're trying to help me out here. But oh my goodness, what the heck? One yeah, guy um, a rope, and he he's trying. He's actually jumped down there into the hole. He's trying to rope it up. It, it looks like it's maybe ten feet down, maybe. Um, yeah, he's uh, gonna hit you down, car. Thank you for calling the Holiday Inn Express of Fort Smith, Arkansas. This is Aaron. How may I help you? Hello? Yes, hello. Hello. Yes, there's a man here. I'm sorry? There's a man here. He said he works what? for you. Uh, he approached me here in the parking lot. Um, I'm not Where are you now? here. I'm out uh, by the four-way here. I'm kind of hanging out by the, the crosswalks, you know, the lights here. I, I'm a little Let me see your guy. room card, or else you got to get off this premises. you got to scoot, bud. Yeah, you're not on. Yeah, you're calling the wrong place. You need to leave. Yeah, you can't. If you can't produce Excuse your room me? card. Or Crispy's voice. Oh, wait. Crispy calling. and Cat never say anything. Anything. Help me help you. Hello? Yeah, were you working there about an hour ago? Um, possibly. What can I do for you? Well, my friend Kat's right here, and she had something to say to you. This is bullshit. Okay, so I don't know who you are or what you're calling about, but if you this just keep prank calling, we bullshit. can't help you. So you have a good night. Okay, no Phone back. Send this Thelma. How can I help you? Velma likes uh, like Scooby Doo. Um, no, Thelma likes Thelma and Louise. Oh, Thelma! Oh, wow. Thelma and Louise. Yeah. Well, why is there uh, an echo? Oh, hello. Yeah. Um. Uh, hello. Hi. Um, is there an echo? Sorry, guys. Are, um, not for me. Hi. I'm not sure Hi. for you guys. Mm, not for me. I'm not sure. You guys? Well, that sounds weird. Oh, sorry. Um, were you guys looking to book? Um, were you looking to book tonight? Um, we needed your help. We're already in a room. We're having a party, and we're getting all this stuff together. We're doing a like a gender reveal party, and we need help setting up the room. Oh, um. Okay. Oh. Um, what room were you guys in? Okay. Um, what room were you guys in? 216. Um, and what, exa- what exactly do you guys need Can you help come with? help? Um, and what exactly Can you come help us blow up the balloons? Um, I can't come up to the room um, like that. If you needed help, I, I could do it down here and get it to you. What's like that? If you need help? Okay, yeah. I'll bring you the balloons and you just blow them for us or blow them up. Um, sure. I can do that. Um, sure. I can do that. That, Okay, sounds good. I'll be there in a bit. All right, see you then. Thank you for calling Four Seasons Las Vegas. This is Leah speaking. How may I assist you? Hello, Leah. Hi. Listen, Hi. we had a little situation. I'm not staying here, but I was here f- with uh, some friends, and uh, I was walking down the hallway. Um, I'm not mm-hmm. really sure because this was a little while ago. Um, I, I've been, I've since left, but um, it was a man um, who was whispering, and he opened his his door, and he said, "Hey, hey, come over here, come over here. I gotta show you something." I thought it was a little strange. I was with my friend, so we, you know, we took a, a gander over, and and uh, it was at that point that he, um, uh, he he pulled his trousers down and he revealed himself to us, and he said he was pointing and he said, "Look at this! Look at this! Look at this!" It's just over and over again, and I wasn't sure if that was something that was normal. Uh, 
okay, normally occurring here? Is that something that, like, is he on staff? Do you pay him for that, you know, the puppet trick? I'm so sorry to hear that. Can I, would you like to speak with security regarding that issue? Well, I was just wondering if that was something you knew was going on. Is that, like, someone that you pay to do that? To, like, a cost to, you know, uh, customers, like, with, you know, that's like um, a... Definitely not. Like no, a we initiation, wouldn't pay to do that. like you're trying to initiate me into some sort of club, some sort of weird sex cult club or something. Yes, I've no, heard I'm about so this on the news. I heard yeah, about so this on 60 Minutes, you know, mm-hmm. and, uh, you know, they covered it. They said, you know, all, all the new hotels now, you know, after the after the vid, now it's all, you know, they're, they're doing like weird sex cults and there's men, you know, dressed in, in suits and, you know, in weird costumes and they're, they're taking people in through the hotels. Yeah, and no, I'm so this. sorry to, that you had experienced that. Let me go ahead and transfer you to security. One moment, please. Thank oh, you. Oh, but what, what, what about you? Can you tell me? Is this normal? Hello? Oh, my God. I'm telling you, dude. They're fucking brain dead. Oh, my God. What the fuck? He stopped listening once. Anyway, if you find this show in the in the future, you can find us at, on uh, immoralhole.com as well as patreon.com forward slash madhouse militia. Um, our old archives are at travelswithmiriam.com and you might have found this on archive.org because I put all the unedited shows up on there immediately after the show's over uh, over here on rogueserver.com forward slash AKSPA uh, Milkman, you want to take us out of here into the future? Yeah. Back to the future? I don't know. All right. Back to the future. The time warp is... <laughs> All right. Yeah. All of us great, groovy people. <laughs> oh, my. Good grief. Here we go. You all right there, Milkman? Okay. What? What? Ground control, <laughs> the major Ground control the major Milkman. Ground control the major Milkman. Yeah, he's supposed to take us out of here. All right. There. Yeah. There's just a little interlude there. <laughs> uh, insanity, Milkman style. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I want to thank all my dear family in this madhouse militia world. Right here, imagination becomes reality every week in the madhouse militia. You know, all of my groovy family and friends can be found right here. Everybody plays nicely together. Everybody shares kindness and laughter. You know what? It's proof that we can all get along if we really want to. You know, our Madhouse Militia is on a journey together. And together we can overcome all adversity, pain, and fear, and anger in our world. Learning that laughing at our problems melts away the grief of troubles as we find that our strength is the power of laughter, kindness, and joy. We're learning that the differences that we have are really trivial and that we're all really more alike than different. That we're healing our collective souls with the magical power of laughter right here in the Madhouse Militia Show. Every week, Friday at 10 p.m. right here in your earballs. All the kids have a great time here, so don't forget to show up. Madhouse Militia is saving the world one laugh at a time. We're dropping the dimes. We only ask you to give us the time and bring a friend, or better yet, bring an enemy, because they're always welcome right here in the Madhouse Militia. And by the way, there will not be a Dwight show tomorrow night, but there will be entertainment to be had. So stop on over to Dwight Cord and witness this spectacle of Cat Machine's big screen. She's always going to give you something to gander at on a weekend Saturday night. I couldn't do it without my dear Herman Lito, the General Lissimo of the Madhouse Militia. Inspiring us all with his groovy waves, bands, and thoughts in heaven. The male at the gold near phones. He's got my big brother, and he is, yeah, he is groovy, baby. And my brother Axel, the man connecting the wheels together and keeping them turned. He's helping me carry this gigantic torch forward. And also want to thank 
our dear Matt, a machine, wasted machine. Thank you. I got, I got stuck for singing. Our dear wasted machine for giving us this stage right here to perform on the backbone of the Madhouse Militia. Thank you so much, dear brother, and thank each of my family members and friends here in the Madhouse Militia family room. Because you know what, you give me a reason to live, and I want to give you all a reason to live. You know, while we carry each other along this long journey. Thank you so much, everybody, and please don't forget to tune in and. Check out Cat Machine's big screen tomorrow night. Much love to y'all, my beloved friends and family. I love you. It's the milkman heading back out into space. Thank you, milkman. Um, Dwight and I are going to do a show on the 3rd, leading into the 4th. So we're going to do oh. July 4th calls. Uh, we're going to treat it like a... Bonus. Um, he, what Dwight described as a New Year's show. So he invites everyone to join us for calls uh, on that night uh, if they want to. And we'll maybe we'll use, the, use this server, uh, rogueserver.com. Yeah, I was going to ask. I think that's probably best. It would be easiest. Throw it out of a mumble. It would be easiest for everybody. <laughs> so, All right, well, I'll cool. be there. Yeah. A bonus show. Axel and D White Machines. All right. And whoever okay. else says good night. So it's open door policy. Love you, DTB. Whoever's around. So. Hey, don't yeah. forget to check your gort. I'll check her right now. I'm falling asleep. Good night, everyone, motherfucker. Okay, good night. Okay, Everybody honey. say good That'll night. That'll get you. <laughs> you sleep. Been fun. I'm sorry I was shit. I, I'll be the same. It's fine. Everything was good and cool. Everybody and did great. Everybody. Um, Everybody did wonderful. We had good calls we got along at the well. Of the show. We had good calls throughout. Mm -hmm. It's just the engagement All the way. and the personality just got a little frustrating of everyone for that we're calling towards seems the to end. Be, seems to be very yeah. flat. So something must have been said about the phone calls that are being had. Maybe <laughs> anybody calls in, and it sounds like they're in a militia. You better be dead flat. This is a corporate <laughs> corporate effort. Sounds the least bit funny. Your your job's on yeah. the line now. Who knows? <laughs> really? You if don't get any peanuts fun, next you week. Better run. Because that's all we pay anyway. Yeah. <laughs> all right. I'm going to go. Uh, I don't know if uh, anyone's doing anything tonight, but go to Dwight Cord. Uh, you can search for it on, on Discord. You'll find it. It's one word. Yeah. Uh, that's our, uh, that's our Dwight. Dwight Cord is also my Discord, uh, but Dwight runs it. It's his thing. I set it up for him, but I don't run it. I'm just there to field any issues he has about it. But it's it's totally his thing. He chooses who's allowed in, who's kicked out. I don't, you know, I just tell him, hey, you know, someone's typing some weird stuff. You can talk to them and see what's up. That's what we usually do. We don't really ban people unless they do really horrendous fucking shit. It's pretty hard to get banned from Dwight Ward. <laughs> Let's just put it that way. You have yeah. to be a real. Fun you really got to be a, a, a dumbass. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Nunu's still allowed in there, and he doesn't. Fuck 